Yeah, it's something and being started with us. Courage should ever see it at the Peace Talks on Monday. At the Peace Talks on Monday. They should have a place there. Peace Talks are not the last any longer than 10 days, but they should have a place there. They should have a place there to mess with us. They should have a place there to talk and have their opinion. The PYD, the Courage Party, the Syrian Courage Party, should have the right to talk on their behalf. Since the war is supposed to two, they're the ones fighting the Islamic State. They're the ones fighting the Islamic State. They should have they should have part of the peace talks. They should have part of the peace talks. That's what I'm trying to point to. They should have part of the peace talks. They should be a part of the peace talks. The Kurds are dead. They're a big bite of you know, the, the, the Muslim nation in Syria. They should have part of the peace talks. They should have part of the peace talks. You know, because Bashar al-Assad doesn't want to go. Bashar al-Assad doesn't want to go. He doesn't want the Kurds there. He hates the Kurds. But hopefully the Kurds will get a place at the table. Hopefully the Kurds will get a place at the table. Because it's not right. It's not right to take two parties and not take the third party. Syrian peace talks shouldn't, shouldn't include the Kurds. Syrian peace talks shouldn't include the Kurds. It's not, it's, it's, it's not, it's not politically correct to leave a group out that's fighting ISIS. You let them have a peace, let them have, let them have a place at the table. We're just where all the Syrians can get together and talk. But the Russian and the United States are where they can all talk. They can all talk about a provincial government for 17 months, which is good, which would be good, which would be good. Sunday, I'm being startled. Thank you for watching.